worthless minions. Come forth now. Uh, yes, Lord Bowser. You guys have failed at destroying Yoshi and his pathetic friends. Well, it's not our fault, it's his. Oh, come on, guys, I did the best of my ability. No, he will get a better salary than all of you. At least he's done something more than all of you combined. Why, thank you, Lord Bowser. I am honored to serve you and be called your minion. Oh, come on, that's totally unfair. You want to know what else is not fair? No, what? That you aren't being burned to a crisp by my flame. Um, never mind. Since you guys have failed, I'm not sure if I can trust you at protecting the castle of our island. Don't worry, sire. We'll protect that tower and get them for sure this time. Well, for your sake, I hope so. I want my milk and cookies now! Oh, can you shut up about that for one second? No, this is my castle, which means it's my rules. And my fat self won't do anything about it. Wee, I can fly! Ugh, that's one annoyance out of my hair. Uh, sir, you do realize if he perishes from the fall, you will cease to exist? Wait, what? I mean, yeah, if the younger you dies, you will cease to exist, like, disappear, gone, forever. Uh, so how about some milk and cookies, guys? Good idea making us hide behind this bush, Marty. Yeah, that shy guy will never know what hit him. Or maybe he probably knew that we were hiding behind the bush. Sorry guys, miscalculation. What went wrong? Well maybe it would have been prevented if Bluey and Louie would have stopped talking out loud. Oh come on, give us a break. Well, it could be worse than this. Yay, now I can finally go back to sleep. Say old chap, I believe we have taken the wrong way. Don't worry, we are going the right way. I can feel it. I do say old chap, we better set up shelters soon. The babies are starting to get cold out here. Yeah, you're right. Boy, I wish somebody here knows how to start a fire. Maybe like a fire-breathing baby turtle or something. Old chap, I think something's gonna land on you. Ow, my back. Aw, oh, man, my wings are too short. Curse you, older me. How dare you throw your younger self out the window. You will pay for this. I will make sure of it. I dare say, old chap, who is this? It's Bowser. Baby Bowser. A.K.A. Prince of the Koopas. Well, whoever it is, can you please tell him to get off my back? Uh... Oh, and thank you for bringing my fall green donkey. No problem, out. So you must be the mastermind. Uh, no. Some old fool claims to be me, takes the crown, and took my title as King of the Koopas. Wait, there's another one? Oh, I could already imagine the trouble we'll be heading to soon. Ugh, so you mean this kid fell from the sky, broke my back, like that hasn't happened before. So, what good are you, kid? Oh, Chop, you can't just say that to the Prince of the Koopas. Well, I can breathe fire. Oh, yeah? Prove it. Okay, like this. Great, you're in. Old oh, Chop, are you crazy? Oh, lighten up, Mr. Storky. You could be a great contribution to our group. Yes, Old Chop, but what I mean is everybody but the Prince of the Koopas. Oh, come on. He could be lost without us. And besides, isn't he one of those star children you've been talking about? Oh, fine. I guess, but I won't like it, Old Bean. Great, you're in. So, kid, can you help us find that fortress we're looking for? Oh, yeah, Mr. Green Donkey, that's easy. It's over there, over that snowy mountain. Wait, there it is! Come on, guys, let's go clean my island back. Oh, this day can't possibly get any worse. Um, excuse me, Mrs. Storky, can you give me a piggyback ride? Yep, it just got worse. <sighs> Pinter, I am so hungry. I know you are, Gwenno, now shut up. Excuse me, good chops, do you know how to get to that fortress right next to you? Out my back. Well, no. Me and my pal Gwenno and the rest of our penguin friends are all starving thanks to the Koopas taking over the island. Daddy, will we ever eat again? Don't worry, children. We will eat soon enough, I promise. Oh well, too bad we can't help ya. Wait, old chap. It is better to make allies than enemies. Let's try to help him as best as we can. Ugh, fine. We'll help you guys. Great. Lucky we got new friends, right, Gweno? We sure do, Pinter. Well then, you guys stay here. I'll handle this. Old chap, you seem to have a bit of a problem on your hands. Yeah, what is it? Baby Mario wants to go with you, old chap. What, you mean him? Go, 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 go. Just be careful with them, okay? Eh, oh well. Come on, let's go. There's no time to waste. Kamek, he is heading towards the castle. The plan is in motion. Ugh, just look at this jump. Hey, look, it's a Goomba. Well, look who decides to show up. So, we meet at last, Mr. Ballerina Witch. What? No, I am a wizard, and this is my broomstick I fly with. Anyways, hand over the baby, and nobody gets hurt. What, him? Not a chance. Well, you leave me no choice, Yoshi. Well, there wasn't any other option anyway. What the? 
Yoshi, I would like to introduce you to Goombas. Hello, Goombas. Bowser sends his regards. Goombas will crush you. Well, here's the thing. You messed with the wrong Yoshi. Now, time to pay. Prince Bowser, may I please take a break? Ouch. Not a chance. So, you come here often? Hey, I'm over here. No, no, I'm over here. Now I'm on top of you. Ooh, you just missed me. Wow, what are the odds of me being in front of you? Enough. Goombas will crush you in revenge of many deaths of Goombas. Not if I have anything to say about it. Oh. And that's how Yoshi take out the trash. Oh no, my powers! I think this is the part where you start running. <gasps> yeah, I thought so. Pinter, I'm starving. Shut up, Guano, I know. Hey, look, food! Did someone order some fish? Okay, children, remember to share with the others, okay? Yes, Dad. Good job, old chap, you did it. Out. You saved us from starvation, and for that, we are eternally grateful. No problem. Okay, soldiers, that plan totally failed. Might as well make a hasty... <laughs> retreat? Going somewhere, traitors? Uh, no. Ah! Oh, we're burning! Yay, it burns! Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! Santa, for the millionth time, Christmas is over. Ugh, sorry guys, this is what Santa does all the time. He always thinks that Christmas is every day. Ho, ho, ho! It is always Christmas on the snowy mountains. Yay, what's up with this weirdo? Oh, you, green one over there. Who, me? Oh, and the exit is to your left. Have a Merry Christmas. Wow, it's a present. Thank you. Well, I'll be. It's my favorite food. This is truly the best Christmas ever. Old chap, it's not even... You know what? Whatever. Oh my, what happened here? Oh, nothing. We were just suntanning on top of a snowy mountain, thank you.